Hey yo, it's Master Q. We do poppy. And we rocking out here with CXSP, you know what I'm saying? You know how we get it. Shouts out to Delta on the 386, man. <laughs> yo, what up? It's Chief for Skates. Welcome back to CXSP, where we always get it first. You know what I'm saying? We've been out of the circuit for a minute, but I told y'all we would be back We're working on some new shit. You know what I'm saying? We got a special guest, two special guests in the building today. Um, one of the guests we've actually had, we started the show with, um, if, if y'all go back and do your research, but we got the special guest Master Q in the building, and we got DJ Guido Poppy in the building, you know what I'm saying? So one time for that round of applause. You know what I'm saying? How you guys doing? Today? You already know what it is. You know what I'm saying? What's up? Yes, I'm back. Yes, I'm back. back. Hey, thank you guys for coming through. I appreciate it. You know, I know. Doubt, doubt. When was the first doubt. of all? You know, thank you, Rito Poppy, for coming on the show. You know, it's your first time here. You know, I appreciate it. You know, Master Q, you're a returning artist. You know, this man has always, been moving always. a lot. You know, we gonna we gonna cover a lot for you guys here today. We got these guys for a little bit of time. But, you know, we can try to get as much out as we can for you guys. So y'all just kind of. Stay with me, you feel me? Don't go nowhere. You know, so we gonna get it rocking. So, um, so Master Q, so 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 what's happening? So last time we spoke, mm -hmm. you know, you were you were, uh, shit. I don't even remember when was the last time that that interview was. That was bro? um, that was uh, I would say six months ago. Six yeah. months ago, February, February. Yep, it was right before I dropped um, Juice, uh, my first visual that was out there. So it was about six months ago, yeah. That okay. was when we had that interview. Yeah, that was basically like the starting point of like your career where you really dropped some shit that I feel like it really kind of dented who you are as a person to the industry. It let people know that like you're serious. You know, you drop juice, you know, your whole career kind of seemed to change around a little bit. You started getting more visuals, you started linking up with more legit promoters legit artists legit people i'm talking about people who run studios who you guys might know some names you're familiar with you know how do you how does that make you feel man about seeing your accomplishments and how hard you grinded from that time to now six months later down the road you know man it's truly amazing you know what i'm saying like it really is truly amazing i'm so thankful for everybody that's been here supporting me and you know straight up hey you know what i'm saying Everything shouts out to my cousin Scooter Pete, you know what I'm saying? We got Scooter Pete in the building, we got Scooter Pete in the building, you feel me? Let's go. DJ Guido Poppy in the building, we got Jesus Skates in the building. Now, I'll tell you this, man, you know, I came with the vision, you know what I'm saying? I seen it, and, you know, now I'm chasing music, and, you know, I've already had that in my mind that I was going to continue to keep on with the grind, yeah. and, you know what I'm saying, now I feel like it's my time to shine, you know what I mean? And, mm -hmm. and, and it's just a blessing to have seen all the success that 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 i've had you know what i'm saying right. from from coming from the bottom man you know what i mean to going to where i'm at right now man it's just it's a consistent wave of everything but bro it's the natural and positive energy that i want to bring man you know what i'm saying because i got love for my city i got love for the dell you know 386 keep it real you know shouts out to deltona and it's all about that positive energy to keep that wave you know what i'm saying growing and strengthening that wave G. right like you dropped a latest visual take over yes I ain't gonna lie, I wake up to that shit and I play it all the time. <laughs> now, I, I like to do analytics on artists myself, you know what I'm saying? And like, even DJs too, anybody involved in this industry, you know what I'm saying? And what I noticed about this video that you dropped mm -hmm. is one, if y'all haven't seen it, first of all, go see it, it's on YouTube. It's easy to search, it's Master Space Q. Let me just say that again because I fucked up, but Master Space Q. Take them. It's real. It's gonna pop up. Trust me. It's the first video. You know what I'm saying? But this video is so controversial. That it's so controversial. Um, what 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 kind of reactions are you getting from people? Because I know when I the, the minute I seen the video <laughs> off the rip, I was like, whoa, this is some savage ass shit. For real. Oh, yeah. You're my brother, nigga. So. <laughs> yeah, right. You know what I'm saying, bro? We family, bro. Like, we family, best believe that, man, and that's like, you know what I'm saying, like, we family like kings, we family of blood, you know what I'm saying, and that's real, you know what I'm saying, that's, that's, that's life right there, man, you my brother, you know what I'm saying, that's my cousin, man, straight up, I got love for everybody, you know what I'm saying, Weedle Poppy, that's my boy, you know what I'm saying, and that man is family, you know what I'm saying, he's always been down for me since day one, now, I'm gonna tell you this, you know, if you're gonna wanna have to be entertainment in this world, bro, mm -hmm. in this entertainment industry, man, you're gonna have to entertain, which right. means that you are going to have to set yourself apart from the rest of the world, bro. Mm -hmm. Nobody is going to wanna watch you do something that they do on a normal, everyday basis, dog. 
Everybody's gonna wanna watch you do something that is going to be captivating. My man, you know what I'm saying? Shouts out, shouts out to Rodney Salmon, you know what I'm saying? Hey, Lope Deezy, he's doing this thing. Artist, you know what I'm saying? Visual one artist. It's one time for Lope, you know what I'm saying? Rodney Salmon, directed by yeah. Rodney Salmon. Oh my God, take over directed by Rodney Salmon. And you know what I'm saying? You know, this man has got, you know, so much experience in the game, shooting videos for Tretch from Naughty by Nature. Yeah. All that. He told me, he said, man, we're going to need to do it controversial. We're going to need to put it in there. So yeah, because I feel like a lot of people, like, they're talking shit. Online, not even just so much with the talking shit and throwing shade, but it's just a lot of people kind of misunderstood really what you meant to portray in that video. Like my promotion on it, right? And, and you know, and these are people that you know, some some of them I feel like know you or have been fans of your music for a while, so they know what type of character you are, you know. So for them, this is also like a culture shock, you know, because. Master Q ain't never dropped nothing this controversial, not not in 2017, you know what I'm saying? So this is this is definitely a new a new height for your career now. What what would you say is something that you're looking forward to in the in the near future as far as like another project like that? Man, I'm looking forward to dropping more stuff and taking more over than I already am, man. And I'm so grateful for everything that I've already achieved from where I'm at right now, man. I'm so grateful for it, yo. Every last one of y'all, you know, that's been looking at the video, viewing it, sharing it, liking it, you know, shouts out to y'all. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. We all appreciate y'all. You know, we love y'all. And, 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 and that's straight up, you know what I mean? Because, you know, you got, your, you got your ups and downs with everything, right? I mean, isn't that life in general that's, that's good and bad, you know what I'm saying? But guess what? It's the balance between the two. You know what I'm saying? You're going to get that no matter what. Right. You're going to get that no matter what. So with the video, you know, I got that. I got so many people that support it, but I got views like none other. You know what I'm saying? Right. You know, the same people that's saying, you know, they saying about the video, they watching it. And DJ Grio Poppy, you know, I've, I've, once again, everybody, like I said, I introduced him, you know, but as an up and coming DJ in this, you know, you and Master Q linked up at a party for the first time I was there. And, you know, for the ones who don't know how they linked, they met at this party on an impromptu set. Like, literally, you were DJing that night for the party. And, like, you somehow were set up to do this, this, this performance with no mic like we had literally if y'all seen this shit it was based and we pulled it off you know what i'm saying we, or i should say y'all pulled it off you know how do you feel about just a lot of guys in this industry who do what you do you know what i'm saying well who's inspirational to you what do you think the game needs a little bit of a change from as far as djing or just mixing music well i say like with the djing you know you got your hip-hop djs you got your scratch djs and then you got like your edm djs too yeah, I love EDM. <laughs> we gotta i'm trying to bring all of it together okay because at first i was just strictly like all edm only right but now you know I, i've always had hip-hop roots and i'm trying to bring them all together because i got my stuff that i do but then i got stuff that me and q are working on and we got ideas that are floating around and i'm trying to get a bunch of other people on this wave okay so what made you like, I guess what sparked like your, your fire for wanting to even like start mixing and just playing around with DJ? I just had a good like uh, ear for okay. music always. And you know, I, I, I play drums. That's what I oh, do. Oh, no shit. So I had a keyboard. My mom got me a keyboard when I was real little. But I found it funny because like, even though it's a piano and all that, I was using the drum pad on it. Yeah. Pretty much <laughs> only. So after that. Started mixing with beats, and I started getting into beats and the hip hop beats, and then start going there and that. And then I was like, "Well, it's easier with the DJ. You don't have to have right, all these right, yeah. instruments." Just, yeah, so you yeah, started yeah. putting it together, mm -hmm. and I just started messing around with it. Who was your first? Um, who was your first artist you ever did a collaboration with? As far as like a show or a show? Uh, prior, homie had a club out Rock Steez back in the day in high school. Uh, actually, was the drummer for his yeah. live band. Back in the day. Okay. Okay. And do you still contact him now to this day? Yep. Okay. Yep. He moved up to Ohio right now, but he's going to be coming back hopefully within the next year. Oh, wow. Nice. I tried to get him and Master Q on a show together, but uh, Roxy's had a family emergency, so he couldn't make it. Now, this is something that I feel is detrimental to the game right now. We're starting to build. Now we're building a house. You feel me? We started Absolutely. with the bricks. And now we're getting the walls up. Yeah, Rome wasn't so we built get in the day. Rome right. wasn't built in the day. You're damn right. But, you know what I'm saying? Patience makes perfection. Can you guys say, what do you have for the viewers to say that the next like, feature you guys may be looking into? 
with, do you have any features in mind with any artists or are you guys looking at any venues in particular you're trying to hit? I mean, I know y'all up I wanna to something. Don't lie to me. I want to throw a feature. I want to hit track. Yeah. Okay. You, know, you, know that. So, okay. you might hear the voice coming up. Okay. Yes. Don't tell me DJ Guido Pop, you got the Drake. <laughs> I know you got some shit coming, Massacute. Yeah, man. You know, we, we, we got some different things that we're working on. You know what I'm saying? Uh, like I said in the last interview, I'm going to say in this one. You know what I'm saying? CXXP is where we get it first. Ain't that right, Chief? Oh, but I will have to say this. Uh, that's TMI, my brother. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, man, shit. Not again, kids, be ready. <laughs> no, on the real though, look, man. Like yeah, I said, right. man, I'm humble, man. I came up from the bottom, man. And I respect anybody who has got the drive, man. Okay. Don't we Don't we know what's up? You know what I'm saying? Shouts out E-Versus. Shouts out E-Versus. Don't we know what's up? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Don't we, don't we got things moving. AKZ. You know what I'm saying? Hey, yeah. Don't we got shouts out AKZ. Actually, you know Don't what? we got things moving. Me and Guido Poppy, we going on the mix, right? Mixing the vision, right? Guido Poppy yeah. doing his mix. Mixing, chasing music. Guido Poppy doing his that. You know what I'm saying? Hey, got something I'm recording and video, visuals coming for you as long as <coughs> a new track, you know oh, what I'm yeah. saying? Remix it's coming. Bump it. You know, on on on, uh, on on Saturday we starting on that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we got we so got, I got things coming. Shit. I got who in this local area um, is one of you guys' favorite artists outside of yourselves? Who's somebody that you guys really consider a good artist in this area or who's repping this area with y'all? Or whether they're here currently or they moved on, yeah. you know what I'm saying? But they, but you know they came from this area. Like, like as in like a like artist, artist. Yeah. Not like producer, DJ, not like that. Nah, any, anybody really. I don't know, man. But somebody that you fathom, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I'm, I'm gonna throw out my boy Odious out of UCF. Okay. Shout this kid's out. making moves. Okay. You know, he started off, you know, playing beats in his basement didn't go to any like production school or nothing like that okay started working with some rappers and i met up with him now he's doing edm stuff too he's got stuff fucking diplo played one of his tracks damn yeah damn and that's around i found him i found him <laughs> okay. right before that so i was like what the fuck yeah see that's and now these boys playing shows out and uh i drive at this place called rum jungle it's yeah the new it's the new yeah. place right now yeah it's hot. So you have any specific venues that you play at or um, somewhere where the viewers can find you and your information? We're going to link it all in there. <laughs> and they can jerk it. Wow. All right. Out here, CXSP <laughs> shit go down. You know what I'm saying? I That's know you would have heard that. We in the Dell. 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 Go down in the Dell. There's a couple places out there. Um, there's a place that me and a couple friends, we play out there at Peak. Okay. Downtown. Yeah. Q's yeah. played there. Yeah, I've seen you. Yeah, uh, Q's performed. They got a bunch yeah. of different stuff going on out there. Okay. But I'm more right now focused on the house parties and events and stuff like that. Okay. And like shows, like different shows. More out. I'm gonna try some outdoor shows. Okay. I'm just trying to get myself out there. Yo, let me shout out my artist. Yo, shouts out to FLA Nova, you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, Nova, Nova the soldier, shouts out to Nova, you already know. Nova, Go on my, 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 my albums, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Check out my <laughs> Chasing Music, you know what I'm saying? Check out that go with me and my boy Nova, you know what I'm saying? Bringing the fire for y'all, you know what I'm saying? You know, such Florida soldiers, that's how we get down. You know, I was doing an interview at 102 Gems, you know, shouts out to 102 Gems. Shouts out to LV. You know, the whole squad over there. Shouts we out appreciate you, y'all. Show us love. Um, Shout out. Straight up. I think you guys had a lot of important things to say there. Uh, what what did you guys ever plan on like going back to that that radio station and doing another interview? Absolutely. And say if you do, absolutely. How do you think it's going to be different this time over? Well, you know, talking with LV is always a good time, ain't it? You know, what yeah, I'm saying LV, cool. LV, nice she knows she knows how to, you know, what I'm saying, uh, keep the convo interesting. You know, what I'm saying, mm -hmm. and she knows how to dig deep. You know what I'm saying? Into the industry. Mm -hmm. And next time I go back to LV, you know what I'm saying? I want to talk more industry, industry. I want to talk, you know what I'm saying? I got some things to say, but I've been out here. Okay. I mean, I've been out here. You know what I'm saying? And I want to talk. I do. So, again, you know, I wanted to thank you guys for, you know, coming through CXSP. You know, we get to chat a little bit with the local artists out here and pushing their shit. You know, I know a lot of you fans out here who do view. Do let me know how you feel in the comment section about the artists. If you want to contact these artists. There will be links in the description as well for everybody. You know what I'm saying? We do this for all of y'all. Um, this is no bullshit, you know? And my apologies because I took a break for a while. I'm sorry. I don't know what's up with this place. But, and we back. You know what I'm saying? We back. I found a lot of new artists. We're going to be connecting with a lot of people. You feel me? And that's going to be the thing right there. We, we making another movement and it's a new fucking wave. So get your surfboards.
CXSP cheaper skates. We out.